What's going on people, Pro Austin Talk here, back again with another video, and today I, I want to talk about, I know that this is like 5 or five or 6 days old, but I want to talk about um, Stephanie McMahon's um, latest interview that came out a couple of days ago, so you probably heard about this on Twitter. So apparently she did, uh, well she did this business call, and apparently she, uh, the words that she said is that the WWE listened to their, th listened to their fans. Now... To a degree, I can agree over on some things because if you look at who's trending on the merch side of things, like your AJ Styles, your Roman Reigns, and stuff like that, yes, they're listening to their fans. And with NXT, obviously, they're catering to the hardcore fans with that, which is good. And you have the Women's Revolution, um, yes, but that wasn't technically a WWE thing. They only started that because of AJ Lee when she cut that pipe bomb promo in 2013. After that, they actually started slowly and surely uh, giving the women more time on television. So, to an extent, I will give Stephanie the credit that she does um, listen to, that like, WWE does listen to the fans. To an extent. I am not seeing it fully because I've said over the years that this is out of touch and I still stand by that. Um, and I, I mean, you can look at the other things that has gone wrong. I mean, look at Raw. Look how Raw used to be back in the Attitude Era, or even more recently, the Ruthless Aggression Era. Okay, you would have two hours of Raw, a, a, two hours of SmackDown, and that would be that. You look at today's um, current um, schedule for WWE, you have three hours of Raw. Then you've got to watch 205 Live, then the Mixed Match Challenge, then the, the Smack, then SmackDown Live comes on, then it's NXT again, and then it's a pay-per-view, and then it's a special event. And then it's whatever else is on the network. I know that you want to put stuff on the network, which is fine. I agree with that. That you need to put more stuff to get to. You need to put more stuff on the network to get people buying the network. I get it. But when you have too much content, when you when you have too much content, it's maybe not good because like, um, have you heard the saying is like, um, uh, less is more. If you know what I mean. Like if you give them less content, less content cut down the content a bit then you know they want more of it and the thing and, and the other thing of it I mean look how many guys that they have misused on that WWE roster like like John Morrison um, the NXT call-ups they fucked those guys up um, all of those I could name um, the bad booking decisions they've done Invasion Angle 2001 comes to mind when I think about you know bad bad storylines just the Invasion Angle um, I mean, do not get me started with that invasion angle, but, yeah, to a degree, Stephanie McMahon, um, you know, I, I agree with Stephanie, uh, you know, to a degree, they do listen to their fans, to a point, but on the other side, they don't, because they've done sh stupid shit like the invasion angle, and giving birth to a hand, and misusing of talent, and, um, not, um, you know, not establishing more, um, main event more mainstream main event guys like back in the day like they had like four or five um in the attitude era and then you look at even in the roof regression era like they had edge and batista and cena and orton and uh jeff hardy um and then you look at today they have roman reigns maybe seth rollins aj styles um daniel bryan that's about it and this is the best roster they've had in in many years in my opinion and when they keep signing people, they're just going to end up lost in a shuffle, go on to maybe a SmackDown or a Raw, and then just forget about them. That's it, I was going to be. And Stephanie says that we, we um, that she listens to the fans. Now, um, Stephanie, you do to a point, like I said, but on the other hand, you do not because the stuff I just said. And yeah, what do you guys think about this whole thing anyway? Leave your thoughts in the comments, and I'll check you guys later. Peace.